I don't know exactly. I, I heard the driver say something to the hitchhiker a while ago about crossing the state line. What state? What state are we going to? Where are we going? Don't panic. I don't know right now exactly where the truck is headed. But at least it's going the opposite direction of Atlantic City, which is the important thing. Let's get the hell out of that place. So we made it across the Jersey State line and all the borders. Just into Pennsylvania. All the roadblocks caught us. Maybe our luck will hold out. His wife packed him a picnic basket or something, huh? Then again, maybe there's a little picnic sitting right here and we didn't even know it. Oh, sure there is. Hey, really? These are all personal appliances. I mean, the refrigerator, the stove. What the hell's the matter with you? There's got to be some some canned goods or some food yeah, up here, huh? Right, and I'm willing to claw right into it. Then, huh? we gotta try to find ourselves some clothes too, right? So when we get out of this truck, we can change into something to make a little getaway from here, right? Yes, we get out of here. We don't even know where we're going. It feels like we're getting farther and farther away from Port Charles. Well, we'll just have to choose our trucks more carefully next time, huh? Find anything? Yeah! The is great! <laughs> Well, you know, it's really not all that great because we don't have any can opener. Would you leave that stuff to me? You have a can opener with you? Honey, some people are into rabbit's feet. I'm in can openers. <laughs> See what I got? The table over here. We can make a nice little table here for oh, two. Perfect. Here we go. Here we go. See what we got in there. What we got in there? I got some tuna fish and. Here, open that box of crackers, okay? You know, if we had to, we could just hang out in this truck for days. Get into this mess. <laughs> I don't know, baby, but it is one hell of a mess, isn't it? Yeah, and it's getting worse every day. I made you a promise, you know, that I would clear everything up and I would get us out of this. I'm gonna keep that promise. Over at Dead Sardines, I'm gonna keep that promise. My faith in you. I always will. All right, then let's think ahead, okay? We have to figure out a way to get into poor Charles so no one is going to recognize us. We have to find some proof, too, so that we can at least prove that we're innocent. Any ideas? Clothes? Some of the boxes? I think we can hold off even for a while and look for something to wear. Was it? Well, same goes for the food, though, huh? There you go. So, how's it look? You're the cutest butt. What are you doing? Putting dirt on my face so people think I'm dirty and won't recognize me. How do I look? Cute as a butt. This is it, partner. As soon as the van comes to a stop, we get out the back before the driver can see us, okay? We try to make our way back to Port Charles and get to the ADZ warehouse without arousing suspicion. Okay? You know, you look like a typical waterfront. What can I do for you, officer? New York State Police. What are you transporting? Household goods. Yeah, we're going to have to make a search of your van. Okay. We're looking for a man and a woman. They're armed and they're dangerous. Yeah, I hope your company's insured. You get sued for uh, careless handling. Yeah, it is a mess. Uh, it must have happened when I hit a pothole a few miles back. Well, go take a look. So who are these people you're looking for? Oh, a couple of punks involved in a shooting in Atlantic City. There's an APB in five states. Bonnie and Clyde? Mm -hmm. Hey, 
I'm gonna have to put all those clothes back on the rod now. Hey, sorry about that. Hey, do me a favor. You see a teddy bear in the other wardrobe cart, and don't shoot at it. Hey, we're doing this for your safety too, mister. Waste of time. I've been on the road the last 20 hours. Never saw or heard anyone. There's no one in here. Okay, you can get rolling. We're stopped. 